What's up guys, it's Drax here. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys another short video. Today I'm going to show you guys on how to make Arson Wise Rip Shirt glitched base outfit that you do see in the thumbnail. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get into the outfit. To make this outfit, when you do get to the clothing store, you're going to want to go over here to the top section, scroll down until you find special tops, which will be on slot 22. Go to knockoffs. For me, it's on slot 7. For you, it may be on a different slot, but go ahead and click on knockoffs. And you're going to make sure you have the fake Sasanta Nove t-shirt. If you don't have this t-shirt, I'll show you guys another t-shirt that you do have. But if you guys already have this t-shirt, then that's good. But if you don't, then go ahead and just back out of special tops. Go to designer t-shirts on slot 29. And you're going to look for the black SN t-shirt right here on slot 17. It's not the exact same logo, but it's kind of similar. So if you guys want to use this black SN t-shirt, if you guys don't have the other one, then go ahead and use this. But after you do have your t-shirt, go ahead and go to rolled sleeve t-shirts on slot 24 and equip the charcoal rolled tee on slot 5. After you do equip the charcoal rolled tee, you can then just back out of the top section, go over here to the pants, Scroll down to suit pants on slot six and equip the black slim fit on slot 32. After you have done this, head over here to your accessories, go to gloves on slot seven, and you're gonna look for the black woolen gloves on slot 58. After you do equip the black woolen gloves, go over here to your shoes, scroll down to canvas shoes on slot four, and you're gonna equip the all black canvas on slot 15. When you do equip the all black canvas, you can then just back out of the shoes, go over here to the hats, Scroll to Bulletproof Helmets on slot 19 and just equip the Black Bulletproof. After you have equipped the Black Bulletproof Helmet, you can now go over here to the glasses, go to Casual Glasses and equip the Black Casuals on slot 13. You should see that the glasses and the helmet do merge together. We will worry about the mask later, but we're going to head to our apartment so then we can do the logo merge. After you do make it to your apartment, go into the Changing Clothes area, then you're just going to go to your tops. Go to special tops. If you guys don't have the fake Sasanta Nove T, then just go to designer t-shirts right here. For me, it may be on a different slot for you, but for me, it's on slot 33. And just look for the black SN t-shirt, which will be right here on slot 17 for you. Like I said, it'll probably be on a different slot, but for me, it's on slot 17. So if you don't have this, don't equip it, just hover over it. But for me, I'm gonna go to the special tops and use the fake Sasanta Nova T. So hover over the t-shirt, don't click on it. After you are hovering over the t-shirt, all you wanna do is just hit pause. You can join somebody from your friends list in the pause menu if you don't have anybody online from your friends list. Go to your online, go to cruise. You can join somebody from your crew, your invitations, your friend crew, or your friends crews, or you can go to your leaderboard and join somebody from the leaderboard. I normally join somebody off the IGN crew since, ever, since a lot of people are always online. So once you do find somebody to join off of, then you can go ahead and join them. After you do join them, you should see the, that the logo does merge over to the black World Slave t-shirt. Once you have loaded back into a public session, you will see that the logo does merge over to the World Slave t-shirt, just like this. Now go back over here to the tops inside of a clothing store, go to utility vest on slot 53, and look for the peach plate carrier on slot 44. After you do equip the peach plate carrier, you can then just go ahead and back out of the tops. I shouldn't have told you to equip any head accessories because you will need to take those off. So if you have any head accessories, go ahead and take that off your character. And this is what your outfit should look like so far. After your outfit does look like this, walk up here to the front counter. Go ahead and hit edit saved outfits and save the outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save the outfit, you can now go ahead and back out of edit saved outfits. Scroll down through the clothing until you find heist coveralls on slot 13. And scroll down from slot 9 through slot 12 and equip one of these outfits with a toxic mask. After you do equip one of these outfits, you can then just go ahead and back out of the front counter and head over here to the pier to do the telescope glitch. Once you have found a telescope on the pier, just do the telescope glitch. You're going to run past the telescope like this, here right on the D-pad. You'll see that your character runs in place, then look towards the telescope. That's how you know you're glitched. Pull up your interaction menu, go to style, and go to your outfits and equip the outfit you just saved earlier at the clothing store with the peach plate carrier. When your outfit does look like this, put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, and you will see that the mask does merge over to the outfit, just like this. Now we're gonna head over here to a gun store. After you have made it to the gun store, just go over here to the top section, hit edit saved outfits, and you wanna save the outfit once again on any slot that you want. After you do save the outfit, back out of the tops, and now we're just gonna start up a job. So just hit pause, go to online, click on jobs, go to play job, go to Rockstar Created, 
click on missions, look for the job that's called a Titan of a job and fully start up that mission. Once you load into the mission, just go back over here to the top. So you'll see that the peach play carrier is not on your outfit anymore. Then you can go over here to your tier, to your tops, hit edit saved outfits and save the outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save the outfit back out of the tops, pull up the phone and just quit the job from your phone. So once you've made it back into a public session, run inside the gun store, go over here to the tops, scroll down to vest on slot 47, and you're going to equip any vest that looks like this. Don't equip a sweater vest that looks like this. Go ahead and equip one of these type of vests. After you do one, equip one of these type of vests, go ahead and back out of vest, go to vest shirts on slot 48, and equip the black band vest shirt on slot 14. After you do equip the black band vest shirt, go ahead and just back out of the tops, and now we're going to do the merge glitch. So to do that, if you guys are doing it's a G thing, I will leave a link in the description so then you guys can bookmark the job and then you guys can do it and it's just like Crooked Cop. But if you are doing the apartment merge, I will get back to you when I am at my apartment. When you do make it to your apartment, go into the heist planning board room and walk up here to the heist planning board and out of all the five heist startup, the first one that's called the Fleeka job. After you start up the fleek job, the first mission that's going to have you do, it's going to be called Scope Out. After you complete the Scope Out mission, the second job it's going to have you do, it's going to be called Kuruma. When you have the Kuruma job available, just launch that mission. When you are in the Kuruma job, set your heist clothing to player saved outfits. When you do set your heist clothing to player saved outfits, you can then confirm the settings and then invite whoever you want, like a friend or a random. And when someone does join, launch the mission. When you have loaded into the job and it shows your owned outfit, scroll, scroll to the slot to wherever you did save the outfit and your outfit should look like this. When your outfit does look like this, then you can just hit ready to play. When you are in the job, all you need to do now is just pull up your phone and quit the job from your phone. Okay guys, when you load back into a public session, you're going to want to find a vehicle. It doesn't matter if it's your personal vehicle or a random civilian car on the street. But once you do find a car, you're then going to want to go ahead and get inside that vehicle. Pull up your interaction menu and register as a secure serve or a motorcycle club. When you have done that, pull up your interaction menu up again. Click on secure serve CEO or motorcycle club and go to management. Then go to style and on your CEO style or MC style. Scroll one time to the left and then one time to the right back to none. Now hop out of the car and you will see that the ripped shirt does merge over to the world slave t-shirt just like this. When your outfit does look like this, we're going to go over here to the clothing store and get two of the components for this outfit. Once you have made it to the clothing store, go over here to the hat section, go to bulletproof helmets on slot 19 and just equip the black bulletproof. After you do equip the black bulletproof helmet, back out of the hats. You can now go over here to the glasses, go to casual glasses and equip the black casuals, which will be on slot 13. When you do equip the black casuals, back out of the glasses and for the last component of this outfit, it's going to be over here at the mask store. When you are at the mask store, go, go over here to the mask. Go to Ski Mask on slot 19 and equip the Black Tight Ski on slot 114. You will see that your mask and helmet do combine. Now we're going to go over here to the pier to do the telescope glitch and merge the glasses over with the mask and helmet. To do the telescope glitch, all you want to do is just go ahead and run past the telescope like this. Hit right on the D-pad. You'll see that your character runs in place, then looks towards the telescope just like this. That's how you know you're glitched. Now pull up your interaction menu, go to style, go to your accessories and scroll through your glasses until you find the black casuals. You will see that your mask does come off, but you guys don't have to worry. After you do see that you have the black casuals, put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, and you will see that the glasses do merge with the mask and helmet, just like this. And this is what your outfit will look like whenever you're done. So if you are wondering what it does look like in the pause menu, here you guys go. Pretty cool R's and Y outfit. But after you do make it, you can now just go to the clothing store, save the outfit on whichever slot you want. And yeah, that's pretty much it for this r outfit for, for your male character. So I hope you guys do enjoy this outfit. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.